I always knew this day would come where I would stand before a crowd at my sister's wedding, as I do today, and look the groom in the eyes and say, you are not worthy. <laughs> it needs to be said that marriage is a sacred institution. It's the most basic, most foundational of human society. Now we're gathered here to witness the marriage between Debbie uh, and Kara Kim. You look so wonderful in your dress. I love your hair like that. From day one, she was lovely, sensible, and humble. She was the one friend our parents let us do things with. Whenever we wanted to go to parties and our parents said no, they would change their minds if Kara was going. You got the kind of look in your eyes as if no one knows anything but us. Should this be the last thing? You are such a beautiful person inside out. In you, we found a friend that teaches us, inspires us, and loves us no matter what we do. You are the exact friend that every person needs, and we thank you so much for always just being kind. So in love. So in love. So in love. So in love. You look so beautiful in this light. You silhouette of me. Now, David, he's a pretty, he's a pretty tough guy, uh, and I actually saw him take a proper right hook to the jaw. And when he came home, um, he asked my mum, "Can we have steak for dinner?" <laughs> They just fade out when you take a breath Just say the word and now we'll disappear Into the wilderness uh, But Tabby, on a serious note, I'd like to say this to you directly It's been a long journey, you and me It's uh, funny, because when I was writing this, I actually realised um, I've actually never said this to you, but um, Brother, I love you So in love so in love So in love So in love Lord, we have witnessed your work and blessing here. Two individuals have become one under your covenant and have formed a new family in your name. Minister of the Gospel, I declare David and Kara are now husband and wife. I give you permission to kiss your wife.